farther can I go? we go again. tree is plagued by pestilence yet refuses to die. The goddess Shantia wishes me to save it. I can feel it. Shantia. Not to mention yes. the parchment quality of the Gazette. Ugh, awful. So what exactly did you see? Charmed, I'm sure. Authority. Maybe a few dead cats. I will cure you of your pestilence. You have my word. Let's move. Don't waste a step. She's gone to pot ever since I left. Very well. Faces, hands, and eyebrows. How do we protect them? Watch for wind direction. Put on your gloves. And a light at arm's length. Very good. And what does Uncle Philogia always say? Once it's lit, you commit. Excellent. Now remember, Philogia's fireworks accepts no liability for singed nails, toasted eyelashes, loss of limbs, scalded torsos, or blown off heads. Now, you there, what can I do for you? You feel an all too familiar squirm in the recesses of your mind. He has a tadpole. Ah, a fellow friend of Gortash. Praise the Absolute. I have a special sample, available just for you, if you wish. This one 
will be very useful against any and all enemies of Gortash. Be sure to be clear of its explosion area. Please enjoy responsibly, and nowhere near this establishment. Is there anything else I can do for you? What else? <laughs> I don't know what you mean. We're purveyors of smoke powder. Anything that can be lit, flamed, or fired up. Smoke powder is a beautiful mistress. She will not be limited to one form, and she is quite malleable in the right hands. What are you really asking, friend of Gortash? I see. Then he must not have received my update. You may bring this message to him. Everything is right on schedule. The next batch will be dispatched within a ten day. Exceptional quality, if I do say so myself. The Gondians will know it when they see it. I believe that concludes this purchase order. We very much appreciate Lord Gortash's continued honoring of our humble establishment with his custom. Torches, matches, wizards, or other sources of open flame. Keep them unlit, please. Steady. In the spillage, I know we're picking our teeth out of the wooden doors. There's an apprentice when you need one. Down. He's a bit of a genius, isn't he? At sales, not fireworks. Of course, it helps to have the only license in town to sell the stuff. Steady. In the spillage, and they'll be picking my teeth out of the roof beams. Back for more of Uncle Felagir's finest, are you? All fingers intact. You're not gonna find Uncle Felogir up there. He's literally not alive. Steady. Steady. In the spillage, and they'll be picking my teeth out of the roof beams. Where's an apprentice when you need one? Done. Eight, nine, ten. Good. All fingers intact. Any time to rest? One with the weave. Steady. Steady. In the spillage, and they'll be picking my teeth out of the roof beams. Where's an apprentice when you need one? Done. Eight, nine, ten. 
Keep your distance, down. All fingers intact. Wait, little one. Flower and bloom as I know you should. What am I supposed to do then? Miscreant creeping around? Steady. Like Steady. Any spillage, and they'll be picking my teeth out of the moth beams. Where's an apprentice when you need one? Always nice to be wanted. Done. Eight, nine, ten. Good. Your four fingers intact. You have my word. <laughs> Never a dull moment. Be careful. I bite. Steady. Steady. Any spillage, and they'll be picking my teeth out of the roof beams. Where's an apprentice when you need one? Done. Eight, nine, ten. Good. All fingers intact. Step quick. Employees only, past dear. If you're expecting any packages, they'll bring them down to you. Steady. Steady. Any spillage, and they'll be picking my teeth out of the roof beams. Where's an apprentice when you need one? Done. Eight, nine, ten. Good. All fingers intact. Easy beam. Smoke powder has a distinctive olfactory signature. The slightest variance is as detectable as a spark in the darkness and must be put out.
to the chase? All's well that ends. Not as bad as it could have. Should mind my step. Someone there? Hardly a challenge. Can't give up now. What do you? No permission, not expected. Leave, must leave. No pay, none at all. Enter then, saw nothing, no nothing. Oh, the baby's up. I'm gonna switch to my headset or my speakers. Turn on Canada. Hopefully he'll sit there a little. So we can play a little bit more before stopping. If not over, then through. You're okay. Yeah. How delicious. Should be easy. Hey Google, turn on Canada. Here we go.
Okay, so that opens up another door. There's nothing. You're okay. I'm in here. You do not have an appointment. <laughs> yeah, come on. Yet you seek an audience with Mr. Gary. Oh, there we go. Ah, yes. You are drawn to me. A wanderer bearing the scent of death. There you go. You are familiar with the necromancy of okay. fate. There you go. Yeah, you're playing. The spirits whisper its name. Few books have the power to send a shiver through the living and the dead. Tell me, what did you make of its contents? Such a book is for those who make only the shallowest ripples in death's dark pools. I inhabit the clearly these are not waters Whoops. you know how to swim in. I, I would hate to be the one who that. helps you drown. Perhaps one day the book will reveal its secrets to you. Until then, they're best <sighs> left between its covers. Unless you have any other business with me, I suggest you return to the domain of the living. Well. No, you we don't need that. With a small matter. I have an assistant, no. Thrombo. A conduit I used to maintain my connections with the ethereal plane. Unfortunately, oh. Oh. he has deserted his duties. He has not gone far, but given the sensitivity of his nature, I would prefer that he is not free to roam the city. Uh. Return from yeah. those body to me, and I will see that you are suitably compensated. Why did he run? It's quite simple. He resented having to work for a living. The undead can be rather lazy in that regard. He was always a simple, contented creature. A beggar to the bone. Perhaps he has forgotten how ungenerous the world can be. Or simply prefers to live in the gutter. Rumble sounds like a familiar name. I don't know if I've seen the guy already. In reanimating that wretched flesh of his, then I will take it back. It is my property, not his. I'll think about it. Do not think on it too long, lest my offer be rescinded. Let's get going. What's up for discussion? Why does he have anything to say? If you are unwilling to help me, then I fear we have nothing more to discuss. Anything to trade? Naturally. A few choice items for those seeking contact with the ethereal place. Yeah. Ah. Okay. Okay. I should take the fly. Yeah. 
feel free to return. I was hoping there would be something a little more useful. Failed the perception that there was a door there when I had already opened the door. Really? Behold, this tree is plagued by. Yeah. Ah, oh, you look like someone who can probably read. Can I interest you in um, uh, a copy of the Baldur's Mouth Gazette? Please buy one. <laughs> oh, um, c come back again if you change your mind. Okay, let's see if we can figure this out. Oh, can I make a smoke bomb or anything? A grenade. No. No, let's see. Potion? No. I was hoping you can make like a small bomb or something. Faces, hands. Excellent now. We've done this already. I have a special sample available just for you. If you wish. This one. Please enjoy responsibly. And no any what else? Anything that can be lit? Black. What are you really asking? Friend of Gortash. What? Well, we gotta reroll. Oh, come on. He's done nothing of the kind. I have his latest order in my pocket, and he already has his update on its progress. I know this because I delivered it to him myself. Which begs the question What business do you have masquerading as a servant of Lord Gortash? Understand. We can't be too careful. Uh, okay, what does he have? Water spray. He'll just do color spray, which is not very useful. Once it's lit, you commit. And if it's not a firework, do whatever you like. Ow! Be careful. He's a bit of a genius, isn't he? That Will you stop? Any torches, matches, wizards, or other sources of open flame, keep them unlit, please. What? Good. Thank you, Kitty. 
You're okay. Okay, maybe I'll just give this one more try. I'm gonna save it. I'm gonna do a hard save. You do know the Uncle Falogi is not actually. Okay, stop. Whoa. Kid, you're not helping. Save. New save. What? Yeah, there's more people alive this time, I think. Um. What? Alright, maybe, you know what, guys? We'll try this next time. I'm gonna go before the baby starts getting too fuzzy. Thank you all for hanging out. Um, I'll hopefully be back tomorrow. Uh, Mux has Friday off today, so, or this week, so we might, I might try to do a, um, community stream in the afternoon once we get back from whatever we we go out doing if we go out um and we'll check out some party animals because i did end up grabbing that so thank y'all for hanging out i will catch you guys all when i'm able to hop on next until then everybody have a great day bye everybody